This is what drought looks like in the North Shore Mountains near Vancouver. Every month, Metro Vancouver hydrologists visit weather stations to measure the snow. There's not much to measure 900 metres above sea level. Yeah, so usually we'd, we'd see about two metres of snow here. Two metres, so that's like taller than me. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Over our heads. This is part of the network of reservoirs and lakes that provide Vancouver's water supply. So what it really means is that we need to start thinking already about water conservation as we move into the drier months. This isn't just happening in the Vancouver area. Right across British Columbia, snowpack is low, and there are big worries about what that could mean for spring. The latest snowpack report shows an average snowpack 61% of normal. The hardest hit areas are where most people live. It's just what is extremely unusual is how low it is everywhere. Already, the province has called meetings with farmers to talk conservation. BC Hydro has had to import electricity and raise rates. Oil and gas producers told to make plans to store water for fracking operations. We have communities in local states of emergency because they don't have enough drinking water in February. It, that really starts to make people concerned for what that's going to look like in the summer. Higher in the mountains, the hydrologists find snow. So right now there's about a meter 10, 110 centimeters. About 30% of what we would usually see. There are still a couple of months of winter to go. Lots of snow could yet fall. But the scientists say don't count on it. The near forecast looks dry. Lindsay Duncombe, CBC News, Vancouver.